Make it quick, it's been a long night. I know you brought Noah Dingle in last night. I really want to see him. No can do. Well, please, come on, he's only 16. He left in the early hours, released under investigation. Your, your cane took him on. Oh, right, and no one thought to ring me, his own mother. You best ask Noah. Maybe it was his choice. So no charges have been brought against him then? Not as yet. You know what he was brought in for? Well, obviously, and they didn't do it. You're welcome to fill in any gaps. I need to get back to see my kid. Because if you know anything at all, I know you want to help him. Why did we have to come here? Everyone's going to be staring. Mate, it's dead. That makes no power noise. How is it? How do you expect him to be when the two people he relies on the most dumped him in this mess? Two. Keynes is much to blame for what happened. He got charity to try and set Mackenzie up into some job that backfired. Could kill the lot of them. Join the queue. Well, at least no one's talking now. Turns out he was only at home farm because he realised his mum was going to get caught. And how come she didn't get net? Cos she left him. She ran away. Yeah. He reckons it's because he told her to go, but who the hell leaves their kid to face the music on their own? So much for her getting her act together. Oh, are you kidding me? She's sunk more than ever. Well, there's no way I'm letting Noah stay with her anymore. He's staying with us. Right, well, I'm falling, Paddy. There's no way I'm swanning off on my honeymoon with all this kicking off. Wait, you can't do that. Yeah, Chaz, he's right. If you cancel your plans every time Charity screwed up, then you wouldn't do anything. Uh, sorry, darling, I know she's your mum. Nah, you're all right. She's a total nightmare. Mm -hmm. Thought I could feel my ears burning. Happy New Year. No? OK. Far from OK, I'd say. Look, um, I know I miss your birthday meal, and there's no excuse for that. So, come on, shout at me, insult me, do what you need to do. What, and that would make you change, would it? So, what? It's good to see you. Free. <sighs> Read the room, Charity. Yeah, OK. Got a few things I need to sort out. Not here. Back room. Look, I know you're mad with me, but will you just sit down? You're making me nervous. Almost like I were getting questioned by the police half the night. Yeah, I know. Seriously, I have been going out of my mind. Yeah, right. Drunk and half dead in bed, more like. Do you think I feel good about this? You're my son and you're in trouble. This is the last thing I wanted. What did you tell the police? I didn't mention you, if that's what you want to know. Noah, I'm trying to establish the facts, OK, so I can help you out. We can come up with a plan. Like what? See, this is exactly why I don't want to be like you. The type of person that makes pathetic promises. I can do this. Or ditches their son on his birthday to go off and rob someone's house. The only reason I was doing it was to get cash for your future. You do realise university doesn't come cheap. What future? I'm going to end up with a criminal record. No, you're not, because I won't let it get that far. So what? You'll tell them it was you? Get done for burglary, go to prison? I, yeah, I'd cope. Well, Moses wouldn't. He's too little, he wouldn't understand why you've left him. Well, guess what? Life's tough, so maybe he needs to start learning now at five. I hated you being banged up. Moses will hate it more. I'd rather you risk messing up my life than guarantee messing up his. I'm going to take the blame. No, you can't. I can. You can't stop me. I'm going to let the police think it was all me. Oh, here he is. Scottish Judas. Come to tell everyone what a low-life scumbag you are by any chance. Ah, service with a smile. You can't beat it. Go home, Mackenzie. Yeah, go on. Get back to being Kim's little lapdog. What? You're working for her now? I'm not a fuss who pays me. Point please, Chaz. Don't you dare. You set me up, didn't you? This whole thing was your idea. 
Oh, you think this is funny, do you? Yeah, it's so hilarious that my child might get banged up. I won't. Oh. You've got five seconds to walk out that door. OK. I'll leave you to powwow. No matter how you get into this charity, just get Noah out of it. Do you understand me? Hang on, you're saying that like it's entirely my decision. Well, it is. No, it's not. I've just been in there, we know it. He's insisting on taking the blame. He, he, he reckons if I go down for this, then Moses won't be able to cope without me. He's 16. What does he know? You are the adult here. His mother. And it's all your fault anyway. Chaz, come on, back me up. You get this, I know you do. Do I? Yeah. If Aaron said he wanted to take the rap, you'd let him. So you could stick around for Eve. No, Charity. Because the difference is, I wouldn't put Aaron in this position in the first place. Face it, you can't justify this. Oh, right, OK, so all that stuff about Nate carrying the can for Belle... Yeah, I've, I've just dreamt that up, have I? Well, he's not a kid. No, but no worries. So he probably won't even go down for this. If you let him do this, then you're dead to all of us. Oh, will you just quit with the death stares? Making out like I'm Satan. I mean, since when have you lot been perfect? Just shut up and do the right thing, will you? You're all out of excuses, kid. On time. Well, I'll figure something out. I always do. Noah, babe, please, will you just tell him what you've said? Ignore her. Your mum has to take responsibility, love, not you. Why can't you just step up and protect your kids for once in your life? Oh, I do love to see a happy family gathering. Makes you all warm and fuzzy inside. Oh, go boil your head. A large Pinot Noir, please. On the house, I'm guessing. Sorry, did you not just hear me? I think the least you can do is get me a drink. Especially now I've just got your son off the hook. Just keep the bottle, Kim. Hm. So, how? Unlike you, I'm gifted with charm. I simply confirmed Noah's story. He's my relative. It was an unplanned visit. A misunderstanding. And the police bought that? The investigation's been dropped. Fortunately for Noah, family actually means something to me. No, hang on. I would have sorted this out, OK? I would have done. Noah, you believe me, right? Just say thanks. What? <laughs> say it. Thanks. Uh, not sure I heard that. Thank you. Kim. Huh. Thank you, Kim, for doing what I couldn't because I'm too gutless. Well, at least your son has manners. Must be the Tate in him. Noah, go get your coat. We're going. See you later. Mind the bar. I'm going to go and pack for my honeymoon. <sighs> OK, why? Well, that is the million dollar question. Oh, come on, you hate my guts. So, what have you done this for? For Noah? Or for me? You saw them. They despise you. You hung your own son out to dry. And to top it all, I came riding to the rescue. It was just too good to miss. OK, so all this, cos you get off on seeing me suffer. Well, I must say that thank you was an unexpected treat. Right, so what, are we quits then? Cos you've kind of ticked the ritual humiliation box, haven't you? No, 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 no. That was merely the warm-up. See, you owe me charity. And whenever I decide that I want that debt repaying, probably when you least expect it, I'll come knocking at your door. <laughs>